Hello, my name is Alex Krakus, and I want to welcome you to my Finding Lost Civilization series. Today we're in the state of Nevada in a place called Lincoln County, near the town or the village of Alamo. And in this area, I found a place, I found several hills that had hundreds of petroglyphs. But today, what I'm going to share with you is one special petroglyph that had some very unique elements to it. On this petroglyph, we'll see the symbol of the warrior, we'll see the symbols of the hunt, and we'll find a fertility symbol. And we'll also see a symbol of the alatal. Now, the alatal was an implement that was used for throwing spears and projectiles, and this alatal preceded the bow and arrow. But right above this petroglyph, crest of the hill, I found their encampment. This is where they lived. This is where they communed with their gods. This is where the hunt was celebrated. My God, to not only find a petroglyph in their story, but to find out where they lived, ate, and drank, and feasted is fantastic. So I'm going to share this journey with you, and I hope you enjoyed as much as I did when I found the petroglyph along with the encampment. So let's well, I found a great site over here. This panel, this rock card has a big story to tell. So let's go take a look at it and see what we can discern. As I said, many of these places were gathering places where hunters met, told their story, shaman came here and had their vision quest. Let me show you something right here. Again, this is the typical symbol that we've been seeing here. Here it looks like a hand. Okay, it's got one, two, three, four fingers. Maybe there's a thumb that we're missing. Okay, again over here, two sheep. Look at this here. Okay, let me show you this over here. This is a fertility symbol, potentially a fertility symbol. So, again, this is speculation that uh, one researcher had come to this conclusion. So this panel over here, look, has a figure right over here. You can see a figure here. Another one here, another one there, and then another one there. Again, the style is somewhat similar. They're all rectangular type people, okay? And they all have the representation of the Alatal. Look at this right over here. Hopefully you can see it. Okay, again, we have, looks like the uh, a shaft with a circle around it, the Alatal symbol, okay? So, let's take a close look. This is really beautiful. Okay, let's go back here. And again, there's, there's another figure. There's the head, okay, with the spirals. There is the Alatal symbol. Hopefully you can see that right there. There's another hunter next to it with an Alatal symbol and another person right there. This is really a great panel. And you know, you find these, again, near water, and places a grand vista. Let me show you, this is the vista. And this is where they hunted over here. This was a, a, a dry lake bed at one time. It's a dry lake bed now, but it was a lake bed. You can see that. A great place to hunt. Great place to worship. You know, Indians didn't have churches like we have today. We have buildings. <laughs> they use nature, okay? Nature, the grand vista, was where their church was. Let me show you this here. Here's another symbol right here. And again, the Alatal symbol here. And again, we have a representation of what it looks like to me is like a person right down here. Again, square-like, looks like they have little horns. And again here, let me bring it in real close, the Alatal symbol. So look at this, big flat face over here, beautiful patina, beautiful vista. Oh yeah, I can see in my mind why the ancients were here. I would be here today <laughs> if I didn't have all the modern conveniences. This is where I would come to worship. This is where I would commune with my gods. This is a great place to have an initiation or a fertility rite. Why not? This is beautiful.
Look at this right here. Right at the ends, you can see that it's chipped. And look at the edge over here. So here's what they would do. They would take the skin and they would cut it down like this. This is an old cutting instrument. 